everyone welcome back to another video in today's video i am going to be using these um nail sugar decals these are i don't know what they're called actually but they're ones with the bird cages on and feathers and stuffs and i'm also going to be using this deep space black holographic fine glitter <laughs> glitter uh so oh yeah and madam glam gel polishes so i'm gonna start by applying two coats of white to two nails you actually need to apply two coats of white to all four of the nails that i'm doing today i just wasn't sure what i was gonna do on the other two nails at this point this was another wing it set so yeah two coats of white do it on all four nails um and curing the lamp for 30 seconds each coat this color is absolutely stunning it's called because i said so from madam glam you can save 30 percent on madam glam using my code natmug30 and i felt like this color pink went really well with the pink from the decals i think i've used this one before with these particular decals but it was a long time ago and i can't remember so for these nails they're gonna be they're gonna be stripey and you can either go horizontally or vertically i decided to go horizontally because i thought it was going to be easier than going vertically but actually it was just as tricky i think and i think it took longer because i was doing more of them so maybe the vertical lines would be a lot easier however if you're going to do vertical lines i would use a longer brush use a striper brush because that is you know that's kind of like what they're intended for for stripes so yeah so for both of these nails i'm going to do these little vertical no little horizontal stripes and i'm going to do i'm going to do this all the way down the nail and then this is what it looks like so i got six lines on there in the end i'm going to pop that in the lamp and then i'm going to do exactly the same on this second nail so we've got two stripy nails then i'm going to use is that called witch's hour i'm going to do that on i pointed at both nails but i'm actually just going to do one and i'm going to keep the other nail plain white I also accidentally managed to put one more stripe on that purple nail by accident. Right, I'm going to use one of these big birdcage decals. I'm going to cut these out and I'm going to cut around the decal taking off a lot of the excess. So we're just left with the basically the design. And then I, I only stamp these on now because since I've learned this way, I'm just like, how did I do it the other way for so long and not know about this way? So you just put the decal on the stamper upside down wet the back with some water just wait about i don't know 15 seconds maybe and then the back in will just slide off i dab it with my fingers to get off any excess water and then the decal is just ready to stamp onto the nail and look ta -da, instant nail art oh i love these decals so much right i'm then going to take one of these bouquets of flowers and I decided to grab one of the pink ones. So I've done the same here. Like I'm just putting it upside down on my stamper, wet the back, and then I'm going to wait for the, the back in to... Now I've sped this up times two. So, look, I mean, it's so quick, right? Just, yeah. Okay, so when I went to stamp this on, I realised that where I've got the purple lines the flowers would you'd see it on the decal so i've just put a little bit of white gel polish just where the pink roses are and i have cured this for 30 seconds but you can see i've just put the smallest layer because if you put if you make it too thick your decal is going to end up bumpy so now when i stamp this on the flowers are going to look all even do you see do you know what i mean like if i'd have left it the flowers would have been darker where the stripes are. I'm going to cut off the excess. And then that is that one done. Okay, so now at this point, I'm going to add on these feather decals. So originally I'd wanted to do, I wanted to do something else, but I, this just took me in a different direction. <laughs> so I've got, I've got these feather decals. I've done exactly the same and I'm just going to stamp these on the pink stripe nails. I'm going to do this one with the feather going in the other direction 
And before I do the next part, I don't know why I was wiggling my fingers around then, I'm going to take my velvet matte top coat and I'm going to top coat all of these nails. I do want them matte finished. If you prefer shiny, then you use your shiny. Or if your client prefers shiny, use shiny. I just you know i like if, if you've been here for a while you know that i like matt if you don't if you don't know welcome because you must be quite new <laughs> right now we're going to add the deep space glitter you can save 10 percent by the way on any nail sugar products using my code natmog10 there is a limited edition bundle that is is limited quantity of them i'm not sure if they've sold out yet but it's like a, a more gothic -y bundle um that some of you might like so go and have a look because numbers are limited right so i'm going over this feather with the no wipe top coat you have to be really careful not to go over the you see where the the feather separates you have to be really careful not to let your top coat um s s uh, what's the word you want you don't want to go over the split in the feather okay otherwise it will just it won't look like a feather and then before you cure the top coat you want to sprinkle it with our the deep space glitter pop it in the lamp to cure and then when you brush it off can you see you can still see the gaps in the feather it just makes it look like a feather as opposed to uh, like an arrowhead or something do you know what i mean ari do you know what i mean and then we've got like a sugared feather and I thought that looked really cool. I'm going to do the same thing on this one. This one looked a little bit less, but that is literally the set finished. So I hope you liked it. If you did, please leave me a like. If you haven't already, do consider subscribing. And don't forget to hit that notification bell. That way you will not miss any future videos from myself. But I'll leave websites and discount codes below for you. God bless. Love you all. And I'll see you in the next one. Have an amazing weekend. Love you. Bye.